Hello everyone. Today I'm gonna show you how to do a geo-referencing. I need click on add data, open the file that you want to geo-reference, or simply connect the folder and click OK where your file had stored. Click add. Okay. So this is my top of my file that I want to geo-reference. Its coordinate assigned here does not match with the coordinate here in GIS. So if I georeference this image, then the coordinate assigned in this tip map will match with the coordinate in GIS. So before moving on that, you need to know the coordinate of four intersecting points. That is, this one is the first intersecting points whose coordinate you have you have to know. Uh, this intersecting point, uh, I'm sorry, this intersecting point is just nearby this corner. So note the coordinate of this intersecting point. So X for this intersecting point is given here 24, that is string. So its standard format here is 630000. Therefore, the X coordinate for this intersecting point is 624000 and y coordinate for this intersecting point is 3070000 -0. similarly this is the intersecting point number 1 so this is the intersecting point number 2 just nearby this corner this the left one upper corner so intersecting point for uh, this is the intersecting point and coordinate for this intersecting point is 635000 and the y coordinate for this intersecting point is 307000. So I have sketched the coordinate of each intersecting point in this way. So I have assigned this intersecting point is 1. This is the 2 that is intersecting point. I have assigned 2 and coordinate is 365000 and 307000. Similarly, your third intersecting point is this intersection that is your right below corner nearby this corner. So, coordinate for this intersecting point is given here. The sting line is given here 35 which means 635000 and y that is northing is 58 which means 306000 therefore it is given a 58 which means 305000 therefore x and y for this intersecting point is uh, x is 635000 and y is 305800 always remember that Easting has a 6 digit and Northing has always a 7 digit. Is I have sketched here. Similarly, the fourth intersecting point. So if you sketch in this format, it will be easier for you to later on input the coordinate. So my fourth intersecting point is this intersecting point on left downward corner so x and y for this intersecting point is uh, x is 6 2 4 0 and y is 3 0 5 8 triple 0 3 0 5 8 triple 0 as you can see its format is given here 6 58 59 60 so it is 3 0 5 8 triple 0 now let us assign the coordinate in each intersecting point that we have named. Here you can see a georeferencing toolbar. If it doesn't appear, just simply right click on here and you can see a georeferencing here. Simply click here. Now click on add control points in georeferencing toolbar. So this is the intersecting point. Zoom in as much as you can to minimize the error. So 
simply give a left click here it appears a one that is my intersecting point number one now simply give a right clip and here input x and y so i have already noted the x and y uh, of this intersecting point number one so give x value this one and give y value this one so x value of this intersecting point is six two four triple zero and y is three zero seven zero triple zero click okay now the image uh, now the image disappears that is the image has gone to its actual coordinate in table of content simply click on the corresponding layer right click zoom to layer now assign the second coordinate in second intersecting point so this is my second intersecting point So this is my second intersecting point. Now I need to input x and y in this intersecting point. Simply give a left click and then right click input x and y. So x and y for this intersecting point is 635000 and y is 307000. Is already noted the coordinate of this intersecting point here so it will be easier for me now simply move on to third intersecting point that is the third intersecting point this is my third intersecting point and input x and y here simply give a left click and then right click input x and y is I have already told you that X has always a six digit and Y has always a seven digit. this intersection simply give a left click and then right click input x and y x for this intersection point is 624 and y is 300 now if by accidentally you click here and you get an undesired point so if you need to remember uh, i'm sorry if you need to remove these undesired points then you can see a view link table in georeferencing click on there so this is my undesired points that i need to remove simply press delete button in the keyboard now these undesired points disappear Now, the geo, now we have assigned the coordinate now the part here is rectifying the image so in georeferencing toolbar click on rectify so assign name I have named it as a number one underscore so that my this rectified image uh, won't mismatch with the previous one remember that format should always be in TIFF format. Now remove the output location where you have saved your file. Click on save.
is taking uh, now okay my image is now georeference so in this way you can georeference your topo map just you need to note the coordinate from the topo map is we can see the eastern and northern coordinate here and you can repeat the same process just the difference is assigning the coordinate of different a uh, different point so thank you